What if I were to tell you that we might have Mario Odyssey 2 coming, well, soon? Look, I don't know what Nintendo's doing with Mario. Let's just start there. But what we do have is Nintendo telling us to do something that doesn't make any sense in 2023 outside of a few caveats. And one of those caveats is a Mario Odyssey 2. And we actually have evidence for that as well. So first up, we got an email. An email came in from Nintendo. This email is asking me to play Super Mario Odyssey. In fact, here's the email. It says, what were your favorite voyages in Super Mario Odyssey? Mario's debut adventure on Nintendo Switch was his most unique one yet, from dodging devastating dinosaurs and plundering pyramids in a poncho to getting his groove on at New Donk City Festival. The Mushroom Kingdom's main man truly saw some sights, but there may be even more out there still to be discovered. Perhaps it's worth hopping aboard the Odyssey once more and taking the trip all over again. Now, I loaded up the game just to make sure they didn't just ghost drop some new DLC or some new content, and they didn't. So they want us to revisit Super Mario Odyssey for some reason, and they're noting there might be even more still to be discovered. What are they talking about? Now, yes, we have a Mario movie coming out in April, but I don't think it's a reference to that. There's a lot of games referenced in the Mario movie. I'm sure Cappy and Mario Odyssey might get a reference in there as well, but they could just say this about Mario Kart, right? They could say this about Smash Bros. They could say this about any game they're referencing in the movie. Why Mario Odyssey? Well, if you remember a couple years ago, we actually had a leaked survey for Mario Odyssey 2. This survey leaked alongside the Sonic Frontiers survey, which obviously Sonic Frontiers gave us the name of the game, some details about it, and all those details and the name ended up being correct. And the company that gave out these surveys is a company Nintendo has used in the past for these things. Now, these surveys are not supposed to leak. You actually sign an NDA when you're doing the survey, so they are supposed to be private, but you know, this is the way it is. It takes one person to decide, I don't care about your stinking rules, and this stuff leaks on the internet. So the Sonic Frontiers one proved to be correct, but obviously Mario Odyssey 2 hasn't arrived. Now, granted, we were in a pandemic and all that stuff, and maybe this was supposed to come earlier, but it's interesting that Nintendo is sending out random emails at the moment. You might not have one. Some of you might have it. It's interesting. I've seen some people say they have it. Some people say they don't. Either way, it's weird to see Nintendo suggesting us to go back to Mario Odyssey. What is this? Almost six years later? Well, not really. I guess it released at the end of 2017. So about five years later, they're asking us to revisit Super Mario Odyssey out of the blue. Why? Yeah, Mario movie. Yeah, sure. Nintendo World. But... Really? Really? And you're saying there may be even more out there still. What are you hinting at, Nintendo? What are you trying to tell us? It's almost like they're trying to suggest there's more Odyssey fun coming our way. It could just be DLC. Could be, obviously, Mario Odyssey 2, which, again, we already had sort of leaked a couple years back. So I don't really know which way to go with this. I'm just putting this information out there, and you guys can do with it whatever you want. I know personally I would love another Super Mario Odyssey, and the more I think about it, the more this actually makes a lot of sense because think about it, we're getting a sequel to Breath of the Wild, right? Tears of the Kingdom. We don't get a lot of direct sequels all the time for Zelda. It does happen, but we don't get it frequently. But it usually happens on really well-received and well-selling games. Well, what game was really well received and sold really well? Breath of the Wild, right? Almost 30 million copies. Well, actually, I think it is at 30 million if you count the Wii U sales in. That's insane. So best-selling Zelda by far. So of course we're going to get a sequel. Well, guess what? The best-selling 3D Mario game is by far. Super Mario Odyssey. It's not even close. Mario Galaxy, Mario 64, Galaxy 2, Sunshine. None of those games, not even Super Mario 3D World, can touch the sales of Super Mario Odyssey. It's almost at 25 million. Super Mario Odyssey is a massive success story for the Mario franchise. Now, yes, there are some 2D entries, some side-scrolling entries that have sold better. Obviously, spin-offs. We all know about, gosh, is it going to hit 50 million Mario Kart 8? It's insane. But Super Mario Odyssey is the best-selling 3D Mario game of all time. Makes a lot of sense to have a sequel. And like Zelda before it, you would think we would get the sequel a hell of a lot sooner than we might be getting it. But maybe there's a reason. 
Maybe it's new hardware. Maybe they wanted to wait till the sequel to Zelda release and they wanted to double up again like they did back in 2017 with a Zelda and a Mario. Come back here in 2023. Zelda early in the year. May this time. Mario holiday. I'm just saying. And it's the same year as the Mario movie came out. So it makes even more sense at the moment to get Mario out there. I'm just throwing this out there as possibilities. I don't know what's happening but I could see some reasoning to maybe do it. Why they would wait so long for Mario Odyssey 2, that's a different story because I have no idea why. But, hey, maybe, maybe Nintendo's trying to give us a little sneak peek at that next Nintendo Direct. I don't know. I'm just throwing it out there. You guys let me know your thoughts on this down in the comments below. I am Nathaniel Rubblejance from Nintendo Prime. I always want to thank all of you guys for tuning in, dropping a like, subscribing to the channel. We got more news coming your way later today. Man, there's a couple other stories I'm doing some research on right now that you guys aren't going to want to miss uh, because, man, there's some cool stuff happening right now. Fire Emblem reviews are out there. We got some new sales data and more. So I just wanted to separate this out of its own video because it's a you know kind of sort of a speculation discussion rumor thing. Well, it's something Nintendo actually did, so I guess I can't say it's a rumor. But definitely speculation, because why are they saying there may be even more out there still to be discovered? I have no clue. So thank you guys for tuning in, and I'll catch you in the next video.